Yeah. Yeah. Yes. These have been in the sun all day. More beers. <laughs> We've, uh, what have we done? We've sacrificed a percent. Yeah. To have second chance. Two engine swap. A number of J7. So this one is longer, is a metre longer than normal, which were employed from Narbonne in the south of France. And the plan is that we've removed the engine and gearbox. slow, heavy and big and the plan is to replace it with this. Yeah, the challenge with this is, it's not upright. It is actually level, so the drive shafts are upright, level, but the engine is counted over. to give a bit more bonnet clearance and stuff, but we need to take the cross member out, which we put back in to drag it in, but it does slide straight in, um, but the floor needs a bit of a cutting. It feels so awkward. Help me. So I've got these little stands. Yeah. Let's sit on here, didn't we? Yeah, you do. Had the this laser cut out tin, which is the engine mount for that side, which fits quite nicely. Uh, the plan is to slide it in, see where she fits. So it was family owned, and she had two to move her pots about. Think, didn't she? Is that yes. Yeah, she was um, sold flowers at a market, didn't yeah, she? That's it. So, um, yeah, it's looking like a bit of a relic, isn't it? You can see the bit of alley in the middle. Probably wouldn't have been done by Peugeot, but by a coach builder. Um, yeah. Pumpy windscreen washers. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. A FM AM radio. Yeah. Uh -huh.